What's going on YouTube? Snipes here with TKO Gaming, bringing you guys another Destiny 2 gameplay footage, once again courtesy of Lucky and Buttwipe. If you want to, please subscribe to them. Look in the description below for the link and go do it. And guys, this time we're on the Warlock. Not only did you just see the orbit screen of Destiny 2, my god does it look amazing and gorgeous, but now we're looking at the Warlock, how he's hovering and moving on your screen. You guys get to see some of the new weapons, some of the new armor as well as the dawn blade subclass which is like the sun singer subclass but it's freaking amped up because the super is in my opinion much more effective look at how beautiful that shit looks you guys get to see all the different skill trees you guys get to see this empowering gift you guys get to see like the firebolt grenades essentially everyone's telling me that sticky grenades don't one hit kill awesome you got focus burst as the glide so some of the stuff is still the same but i'll tell you it doesn't really act the same because just like i said in the first video the destiny 2 gameplay is slowed down quite a bit the pace of the gameplay is slowed down quite a bit so guys this is so exciting look at this sky fire holy shit phoenix dive you can dive and shit and f people up with your super igniting touch a powerful melee ability that ignites enemies this is a subclass to fear and honestly guys i want to know in the comments below what you guys are going to be maining are you going to be maining a hunter warlock or titan as you guys know the hunter got this walking dead black dude stick looking like thing that he goes around just swiping at people you got the freaking titan who's like the purple captain america and now you got the warlock always an op ass class and as you guys know this is the countdown playlist and we're going to be playing on the map midtown it's going to be pretty epic now keep in mind guys this is the first game that they played so they're still trying to figure it out controls and all that kind of stuff so it's not like they're going to be experts right now and really nobody is obviously you got to get used to the map the gun the gameplay the movement but for the most part what I've heard from a lot of people is that the gameplay is very similar to Destiny 1, which is a good thing because Bungie is not straying away from what was working for them. The sounds are very different. You have different sounds for your guns, your grenades, your flying and jumping and whatever the hell you else want to do. It's kind of crazy. As you guys see, the layout of the game looks super cool. It's much more descriptive and essentially what Bungie was trying to do is they were trying to make it so the average noob who plays this game will get all the information just like the pros know like for example if you're playing against really good people and you have your super in destiny one they're gonna know you have your super and they're gonna call it out and whatnot but in destiny 2 now they announce pretty much everything for you as you guys saw some heavy ammo kills will be happening in this the power weapons i should say that's your third slot you can choose what you want it could essentially be like a rocket launcher it could be anything else oh and another cool thing that you guys should know is if you're around the heavy ammo or the power ammo only one person can pick it up it's not a collective pickup so it doesn't matter how many people are next to you when you pick up that box only one person is going to get it that's pretty cool we're going to see some cool ass super gameplay happen as well for this warlock and if you guys did not know the warlock does have a health pool kind of thing where if you stand in that health pool you will not only get an overshield but a little boost to your overall health and i think regeneration as well the ammo and the weapons are pretty cool because now not only are you going to have a primary and secondary that pretty much act like two primaries but then like we said earlier you have the power weapon in the third slot so it'll be very interesting to see what people use now i was seeing shotgun footage as the power weapon from some people and guys i'm telling you it is a powerful ass weapon it actually reminds me a lot of destiny one shotgunning currently so it really would be interesting to see how it plays especially for different guns because as you guys know these guns that we're seeing are most likely going to be the lower tier weapons and obviously with the higher exotics and the better weapons they get it'll be more and more powerful now i do like the fact that they added some cool new abilities as you guys saw in my last video the titan has this like little barrier that he puts out and you can essentially use that as a head glitch now the warlock has this health pool thing 
which is also pretty cool but honestly guys do not be in mid-air as you can see a lot of people in mid-air in destiny 2 are saying that it is not that effective but man am i excited for if you want to call it a smg you want to call it a mini auto rifle whatever you want to call it i'm excited for that as well as this new game type it's really cool it's like a search and destroy you can choose to play the objective or you can choose to go and kill people and eliminate them it'll be interesting because this could even possibly be a trials of osiris or should i say trials of the nine playlist because as you guys know they said the new trials playlist is going to be trials of the nine which makes me think are they kicking brother vance out is this going to be something that we go with worm mcdickface i mean zur and we have to go to zur and pick up a passage from him that'll be an interesting thing to go forth and utilize now i'm very very happy about the fact that sticky grenades are not a big factor as far as we know for the people that have played they're saying hey sticky grenades are not that great they're not a one hit kill anymore and to be honest not a lot of one hit kill weapons are even out there melees without being charged take three hits to kill melees while charged take two hits to kill that's pretty cool as well and then one more thing i wanted to add is the fact that i don't know if it's dedicated servers i don't know what it is but the truth is that not a lot of trading happens and in destiny 1 as you guys know people always trade in kills but from what i've heard from people who've played a couple hours three hours of gameplay that they had not traded even once in all of that now i do want to say that granted the hand cannon that we see on screen or the weapons that we see on screen aren't going to be that great but i do see as i said before the kill times and the drop damage very very significant i know it's kind of similar to destiny one but that is a little bit cool because it really is gearing more towards a halo gameplay style rather than a call of duty gameplay style which personally i like because i've always been one of the biggest halo fans i don't know about you guys let me know in the comments below now i am excited as you guys know me i'm most likely going to be a warlock or a hunter in destiny one i made a hunter for the most of my destiny career but as you know warlocks are op as f and i cannot even wait to see the other subclasses and the other supers that they do come out with but guys let me know what you think of destiny 2 so far i like what i see i really really do and i can't wait to see some more of the weapons and gameplay as time goes on and as you guys know i wasn't able to make it to the destiny 2 reveal this time around but there will be more opportunities and i promise you guys i will be there doing the best that i can showcasing the best that i can and obviously let's enjoy this beautiful ass phoenix super of this warlock i don't even know what the hell is going on but this is crazy dude i feel like you can do so much damage with that super oh my goodness i can't wait raids are gonna be so much fun there's a lot of new new videos and if you guys haven't seen my videos about destiny 2 or pretty much everything that did come up in regards to the live stream please do check that out on my channel most of all the important information is there thank you guys so much for watching i really hope you guys enjoyed this footage i'll let it run out till the end so you guys can enjoy some more and kind of just hear what it sounds like kind of visualize playing it and seeing how it is also keep in mind that rumors are that they are locked at 30 frames per second for console and pc will have unlimited potential in terms of frames per second that being said battle.net slash blizzard will be on board for destiny 2 and the release for pc will be at a later date rumors are around christmas and i think that's smart because otherwise console destiny 2 sales would tank and you guys know that PlayStation's partnership with Destiny 2, they do not want to tarnish that relationship because PlayStation really did believe in Destiny 1 before anybody else, which is a big round of applause for them. And honestly, anything that Bungie does come out with, please believe in them because guys, we know from Halo series, especially Halo 1 and Halo 2, and even Halo 3, Bungie is amazing. Thank you guys so much for the love and support. Make sure you subscribe to TKO Gaming if you haven't. Once again, thank you so much, Lucky and Butt White, for the love and for allowing me to use the footage. Everything is in the description below in terms of links and connecting. Please do so, especially for the Destiny 2 giveaway. We'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, guys, let's connect. Let's talk about Destiny 2. Let's get hyped. Peace out.
charges are everything. Set them and protect them. Only one minute left. All teammates down. Again. Your enemy has match point. Fight your way back. Guardian down. One minute left. They set a charge. Get out there and defuse it. Guardian down. Not out. Okay. Countdown, test your patience under fire. You can do this. <laughs> 